He was my oldest son and now he's gone. I don't have him no more. That grieving mother says her 16 year old son was shot and killed in a fight over a girl. It happened in North Las Vegas Tuesday afternoon near 5th and Centennial. This is our top story tonight. News 3's Max Darrow joins us live as this community remembers the young victim's life. If you were here yesterday, you would have seen crime scene tape right where we're standing. But tonight, you'll find candles and words of well wishes here. Emotions were high tonight as this victim's mother shared what she's going through with the community. I don't understand. How could someone take my son life like this? How could you do this? His name was Lamadre Harris, but those close to him knew him as Man Man. He was 16 when he was shot and killed. I was not ready to bury my son. I wasn't ready to say goodbye. And you know what? I didn't get to say goodbye to my son. I didn't get to tell him that I love him. It happened on Tuesday after school in this shopping plaza's parking lot. At this time, police do not know what led up to the shooting, but they say they think Harris knew the shooter. His mom, Sydney, says she believes she knows what happened. No, he was not in the game. My son was killed over a girl. It wasn't over a fight that they had. It wasn't over a gang war that they were doing. It was over a girl. I'm gonna make sure I get justice from my, for my son, period. I'm not gonna let this ride. And I mean that, cause I need people to wake up. Amen. Amen. I need parents to wake up, teach your kids different. Gun violence is not the route to getting something done. You don't have to kill someone to make a point, to prove a point. My son is gone, and no one can ever give him back to me. While LaMadre's name will live on, his mom says we all need to focus a little bit more on love. Y'all have to love each other when y'all are here. Don't bring the memories when you gone. Period. Start embracing each other now, because if you don't, then it's going to be too late. Tonight, North Las Vegas police tell us they still do not have a suspect in custody. Now, meanwhile, a close family friend has set up a GoFundMe for this family's funeral expenses. If you'd like to contribute to them, I posted a link to that GoFundMe page on my Twitter, and we also have it on News3LV.com. Reporting live tonight from North Las Vegas, Max Darrow, News 3. A mother's, mother's powerful call to action for more hugs, more embraces. Max, thank you for that. And these three will stay on top of this heartbreaking investigation. You can always follow Max for the latest on social media at Max News 3 LV.